time for another slide. Oh, that was a rock on my butt. I got air there. Today is a big, long hike. Closer to 11 hours, maybe 12 hours, maybe 10 hours. We're doing Black Dust in Garibaldi Park. Heading down now. We're about a half hour behind our anticipated schedule because we went out drinking yesterday. Sore throats and everything. How you feeling? Uh, I got the like whiskey talk or whiskey voice. Oh, well, even though I wasn't drinking whiskey, this should be fun. Locked and loaded. We missed the turn off. Now we had to detour. Here's a lineup to get in the park for Black. At least I didn't anticipate this. All right, Duncan's just introduced my new vlogging camera. It's kind of embarrassed by it, but you won't, you'll appreciate it when we're up top and it's windy and we can hear Black Tusk Viewpoint, 14 km. Duncan's trying to be a hero right now and just rock his pants for a bit longer. I'm trying to explain to him the feeling of air on your calves right now. <laughs> You're gonna regret this decision, I'm telling you. You're always looking at the sun. Barren area. Scared? No. Okay. We can handle all three of us now. So in case you were wondering who this random guy is we found hiking, uh, he was doing about the same pace as us coming up and uh, we kept pace with him. Let me introduce you to our new Belgium friend, Olivier. Say hi, hi to everybody. <laughs> our first batch of snow. Time for lunch. Ham sandwich, tomatoes. Nothing fancy, but it'll do the job. I'm mm -hmm. gonna pick it on the camera, but bugs are swarming us, nipping at us while we're trying to eat our food. That poor guy had a black fly take a nip out of him. There's one of them. This is no good, they're so far ahead. I chose to wear runners. I just keep slipping down this hill, it's horrible. It's like I'm on a treadmill. One foot forward, two foot backwards. Look how fun that looks, just sliding down. More snow. <sighs> but at least I hit loose gravel there. We go across the ridge line, loop in front, and then go up the chimney from there. Just keep sliding down. So hard to get traction here. Just when you think you're in good shape. <sighs> Stop and take a breather. You see that? We did the last grainy scramble right here. And all we have left is run along the side. The, thrimney, the chimney, which the guy I just talked to down there said is three meters. But what you have to be careful of is uh, if there's someone going ahead of you, apparently sometimes when they grab the rocks, it comes falling back at you. So you just have to basically wait till it's clear and go one person at a time. Otherwise you get beamed in heads with stones. You don't want to fall off there into the hole. We're going straight up through there. That's the chimney there. The guy told me it's about three meters. That looks a hell of a lot higher than three meters. Well, maybe that's not the same three meters. Yeah. <laughs> three meters from a different country. <laughs> Uh, 
top of Black Tusk. Boys, would you grade that at a 10 difficulty? Well, he's probably, a he's probably like a one or like... Seven? <laughs> it's like, that's just a walk in the park. Seven and a half? Yeah. I'd say seven and a half for me. That was definitely, uh, the first one was a little sketchy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not a huge fan of heights. So. Yeah, that, that part I got really... There's this one part where, uh, we were going like vertical and I was like clawed on. My next foot pole I couldn't reach because I'm reach because I'm so short. And so like other the other side was like all that loose rock. So I'm like, I can push myself over, but if I do that, I'm gonna slide down all those loose rocks. I was so scared. I was about to yell for help for you guys, but <laughs> I kinda did that pivot thing where you're like two sides of the wall. Wow. That's oh. cool. He made it look so magical though. I know. That's, that's the Majestic. Thing. Just like, up there, no problem. <laughs> I think we need to go for climbing classes with Olivier. Yeah. Someone was celebrating with a cig cigar. Oh, the cliff's right there. Yeah. Almost done our little snack, but I wanted to show you guys something. There's apparently some people that come up here with tents and they set up right here in these little shelters. It's uh. They're getting their wind protection here, in here. All good breaks must come to an end. Packing yeah. up now. And we came here for one reason, and one reason only, to dip in this lake right here. Time to cool off. Sounds so weird. When you're stepping on these things. Olivia is entering the part we're most scared of. So if you ever want to see the look of fear, this is what the look of fear looks like right now. Kind of a nervous laugh, yeah, yeah. but we're scared. Great, I'm about the halfway point of the scariest part of the climb down. I had a bit of a panic attack up here. Duncan's about to drop into it right now. Right there I had a panic attack. So scary. I didn't have any grips and I had to like tuck myself under this hole. That's it, I'm down. That was scary. Olivier, well done. thanks for the advice. This guy gave me advice here, I almost turned around twice. Would have got myself in big trouble if I did that. All right, high five, group high five. Group high five. Yes, good well job. Done. So fast going down, you just slide. All right guys, I've had enough uh, walking. I'm gonna take the slide down. This. <laughs> Now we're skating. Now it's not all fun and games. This is the slide where people get hurt. The blood slide. I don't want to try that one. Ben versus Ben. Two slides. One man wins. Three, two, one, go! Oh, yeah, first time. We have a winner! Oh, that <laughs> Why'd you get sideways? I lost control of the top. I lost control. <laughs> I was going back. Let's see if he jumps to my hand. Hey! Oh. <laughs> I didn't even have food yet. <laughs> I was, I, like I was looking for that one, and then yeah, his buddy goes. Like We're here, but we gotta find out where everyone goes to, to swim. Listen. So, we got out of there. It was actually not that bad with the cold. It was mainly the rocks on the base, but look at that thing. Oh man, cut myself on these lava rocks. All right, so we're eating sandwiches to go. Thankfully, we don't have to climb. We're just heading back to a switchback. Well, at least drone? I think someone's got a drone here. Somebody's got a phantom. Right above the dock. I 
Test parking lot, nine kilometers from here. Final few steps. We are at the parking lot. High five. Well done. High five. Well done. Good, well done. Hike, good hike, good hike. I give that well two done. thumbs up. What time do we have now? 10 to 7. So we did it in like eight. Eight and a half, nine, nine, nine and a half hours. Nine and a half hours, that's a pretty good pace. That's really. Well, we stopped for a while. Yeah, yeah. Plus Inclu including the swim. Swim, yeah. swim, which took a time, but. Also, I probably get that two thumbs up on that one. I would give two thumbs two up. Two thumbs up, two yeah. thumbs up. 20 minutes down the road, it's time for us to grab a beer. That does not look good how big that line is. Horrible experience there. What My, bad. My bad. My <laughs> bad. What's this place I've called? Never, I, can't even, I don't even know what it's the called. The Shed. The Shed? Is that what it's called? Yeah. Okay. The Shed here. I've right on the river. Uh, really a, nice place. I mean, for, cool for vibes. Rich, it's really le well located. Yeah. yeah. For the record, I've had nothing but like good service there. <laughs> and like, it's been good every time I've been. <laughs> but this time we go there. And the lady warns us after she takes our orders that uh, it'll be one hour. We thought, no, nah, it can't be. Like, let's call her bluff. Like, it's gonna be a half hour. Sure enough, it was an hour. And not only ten. that, how, we ordered before two people uh, directly beside us. And they ended up giving our food the two fish and chip orders to the people beside us. And the poor waitress had a look of like fear on her face after she did it. Oh, it was unimpressive to say the least, and it was not worth an hour wait. No. I don't wait for anything anymore. No more. No more. Not <laughs> happening ever again. I'm yeah. not waiting for food. Oh we just hacked Wendy's. Life hacks. Right here. Jesus 99 cent frosty deal. Or 229 for a medium. So we ended up getting four small instead, and it still works as a cheaper. Oh yeah, frosty time. Yes. Four of them. We oh, got a road this road is frosty. way too much. <laughs> yeah, range fees already. Ah, I can't <laughs> eat this brain freeze. Oh, this is so good. <laughs>